flow today I'll explain how to make an autofill program I will register here is my email and then hit submit then another form will appear email address confirm it and then choice and then a password how I can make an autofill program that fill this form automatically okay in C sharp we have a class called send what the class send does actually uh, the send class uh, it uh, it is used to send key to send keys. Uh, it has two methods: the send the method and the send wait method. The send the method will send the keystroke to the active application. The send wait method will send the given key to the uh, to the active application and then wait for the message to be processed. Here we use the send the send method. So I say I say that we have a send key class. The send key class has methods. We will use the send method and then write into the double quotation like that the send key class and then the send method you write between the double quotation your own expression or your own code what is meaning of your own code if you write back space then it's meaning that you wanna to use backspace if you write break then you say to the compiler that you want to use break and so on you can write any text so you can write a code or you, or you can send a text we will see how we will do that okay if I wanted to show my task manager what can I do so easy uh, alt and control and delete the alt represented by the person sign and the control represented by the current sign okay and delete is delete okay mm. here is here is alt control delete alt control current delete to show the task manager actually it you write it between double quotation like that okay this is control first I have two timer the first one will fill data how it can fill data the method fill data I'll go to it it has send key tab to move between controls and another tab then I anchor on the first control the first text box so I said 
that I want you to control A to select any text in in the text box then backspace to delete it then send fake emails or any email you wanna what is the fake email uh, it's, it's actually an a string array and the X is the string or the index of it okay this is while you load the form I declare an array called fake emails then I declare a new object called new string and it has this value okay okay then I said web browser dot navigate this URL okay and then I declare an event called document complete document completed when the document completed then fire the event and handle it to start timer one dot to start timer one uh, okay this is the web browser component I said I wanted to navigate and declare an event and handle it when you fire okay and the start timer one timer one will go to fill data fill data will send the tab to hover on send two tabs to hover on the first control then control A delete any text on the on the control send index or element number one actually x I declared it it equal it equal zero okay okay then send the key send the key tab control A delete here I am in the control number two here confirm email address okay control A control A then delete after you delete it give the element number zero and then increment so you give me the element and then increment the value of x it will be one then send tab key send tab control a delete here to write a password tab to move to another control and the password to confirm the password then enter to hit it hit the form or send the form uh, we wait a bag of times about 1000 and 1 and 20,000 minutes to confirm the response okay here is the timer too okay when time when the timer two take another or the web browser will navigate the same URL and I'll declare the same event and then stop the timer I loop why I loop why I say timer1.stop then timer2.start 
I see that because I wanna a back of time to to confirm the response about one thousand and twenty minutes and the twenty milliseconds sorry not seconds or not minutes it's a millisecond okay this is the timer two when it takes it will do it will okay it will do that and then if you if you reach the size or the length of the string array then say mission complete and read dot sleep and then exit the application okay let's start okay 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 these values of emails of the array of string that I declared before okay we see that the form automatically complete complete or filled automatically Okay. When it reach uh, the length of the string array, it will write here mission complete and then oh an error occur. Okay, okay, okay. Stop. Okay, this is the program, an autofill program. Okay. The autofill program, if you send many requested at a time, the server will be limited or restricted to response. So what I, I'm gonna to do right now to say that we can delete the cookies of the web browser component. You give, uh, you give it its constructor, the index that you wanted to start it on it element number zero of cookies and you have 30 cookies to delete or to remove uh. okay this is the program you can add once on the firefox or whatever you the browser you use an autofill program and then you make a special profile to 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 complete any form so this is the program the link to download the program below this video uh, it will be available on my forum programs repository uh, below below this video okay this video represented by Ahmed Zakaria okay